Tonight in Fairfax County, new technology will enforce safer driving, especially around school buses and children while they get on and off their school buses. Yeah, elected officials have pushed for this for over a decade. Our Haley Mylon is in Chantilly with more. 50 school buses will be outfitted with traffic cameras on various routes throughout Fairfax County, and police tell me that they think these extra sets of eyes out on the roads will tamp down on reckless driving around students. You don't want anybody's child to be hurt. Debbie Koshansky drops off her grandson at elementary school in Centerville, and she sees drivers disregard bus stop signs all the time. So we're watching all the time. Those of us, the mothers and grandmas that are there. A new solution coming to 50 school buses in the district in spring of 2024. We're going to try to deter the person, maybe put their phone down. Lieutenant Harold Morris oversees the Fairfax Police Traffic Safety Services. If a camera captures someone running a bus stop sign, the camera vendor, Vera Mobility, will validate the footage and send it to Morris's team. A police officer will then review the case and issue a citation if warranted. If you get caught, you'll be mailed a notice with a link to review a five second video clip of the violation and a link to pay the $250 fine. A long time coming for board chairman Jeffrey McKay and Drainsville District Supervisor John Faust. Uh, I listened to this, the bus drivers honking at the cars passing, which is literally about all they can do about it. Faust has pushed for the camera since 2011 when the technology became legal. I see it all the time. People driving through the bus stop uh, uh, flashing lights. Since deploying speed cameras in August of 2022, school zones have seen a 33% reduction in speeding. Those are the kind of results that community members want to see here. If you don't see it, you, you know, you've kind of become aware that maybe I need to be careful. Although citations will be sent to the address associated with the car's tags, the driver, not the car owner, will be charged. In Chantilly, I'm Haley Mylon, DC News Now.